the Journal of Child Psychology and Psychiatry, celebrating 60 years of empirical research, clinical studies, and systematic reviews. For details of our 60th anniversary celebrations, visit www.acamh.org slash jcpp60. Follow us on Twitter with the handle at the JCPP and use the hashtag JCPP60. My name is Tineke Oldehinkel. I'm a psychologist and an epidemiologist working at the University Medical Center of Groningen in the Netherlands. I've been a joint editor of the JCPP for about three years now. Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm extremely honored to be part of that team. And uh, well, I couldn't have imagined this when I started working in the field that I one day would be a joint editor myself. And um, it's, it's, it's exciting. Uh, it's also sometimes a bit, bit scary almost, uh, but uh, I'm very motivated to, to, uh, to try to contribute to maintaining the, the high level um, of, the, of the, the journal. Yes, well, I think that it's more and more important nowadays to have reliable sources of information. Um, and um, that, for, to me, uh, that is one of the, uh, the, the key tasks and also the key challenges for the future to remain a very reliable source of information and to let people know that they can trust your information. I think, I, I hope, but I also think, I really think um, that the role of JCPP can be growing in the future. Uh, and it may seem like a paradox, but uh, just because there's so much uh, information and so many alternative uh, sources of information, um, that uh, the role of JCPP as a sort of um, pre to pre-select the most relevant and the most important things from all the, this, this, this wealth of, of, of data and facts and figures, uh, I think that only gets more important, that will get more important in the future. Well, this is, I think these are really exciting times because um, the, the technology has, is making new uh, areas of research and new applications of uh, um, research techniques um, possible at such a, a high speed that, uh, well, it's almost impossible to keep pace of it. Um, what I'm really thrilled about is the possibility of um, more personalized assessment, more continuous assessments by means of wearables and uh, smart, because of smartphones you, you can follow individuals on a daily basis um, and that offers so, so many possibilities. Um, this is really something that I'm really thrilled about. Uh, and it's also, it's, it's, it's pioneering work. There's so much happening on, on a statistical methodological level, uh, in terms of uh, concepts, interpretation of data. Uh, so to me, this is a really exciting field. To be part of the advancement of child and adolescent mental health, visit www.acamh.org.